Good afternoon, welcome to Stranded Sailors Wines. Today we're going to do some bottling of this watermelon wine. I've got a beautiful pineapple wine here that I'm enjoying a little bit of. Cheers, welcome everybody for taking the time to tune in to my videos. Ah, ain't that lovely on this hot Saturday afternoon. Pineapple is just a thing to to give you that refreshing feeling on a hot Saturday afternoon. I'm going to put this, this bottle back in the freezer. While we do a little bit of bottling this, this watermelon. Here's a little product presentation. 2022. Tropical pineapple, 13.5% alcohol. I'm going to start, I'm going to pull the airlock and the bong out, and I'm going to set it in a cup of star sand. In the interest of doing a short video, I'm only going to bottle about eight bottles. Try to keep this video short. I've got some bottles from last year that uh, washed with star sand. So these have been sanitized. So I'm going to reuse them, but you need to sanitize anything that you use. You can reuse the bottles with labels, just make sure to wash them with star sand. And you're going to go about a quarter inch up in the neck. Like I said, to be in the interest of, of a short video, I'm only going to do about eight bottles. Voila, there's your first bottle. Nice cap inside. First bottle. And it's perfectly fine to reuse your bottles. Just like I said, make sure you wash them good. And you want to re, uh, use star sand, restaurant grade sanitizer. Make sure you get everything sanitized. And there is some bubbles with this, you see. So you have to take a little bit of time when you get to the top, but I think the bubbles will subside as you get get down a little bit. And I'm trying. I'm gonna try to do a shorter video because the real long videos don't get as many views. So I'm only going to do eight bottles this time. I'd like to thank everybody for tuning in and taking the time to watch my videos. Thank you to the new subscribers. I greatly appreciate it. Please like, share, subscribe. Take the time to drop a comment. I greatly appreciate it. Now this is a watermelon wine. was made on... June the 30th, I think it was. This is a 12.5% alcohol. Twelve and a half percent alcohol by volume. The pine uh watermelon's very, very tasty. But if you can see it's not pink, it's more of a yellow color. And as it sits in the longer it sets, the more clear it'll become. It's a very, very good, tasty wine. I enjoyed about 18 bottles out of it out of last year's batch and loved every drop of it. And remember, if you drink, don't drive, do the watermelon crawl.
know why some bottles bubble up so bad and some don't. Some bottles don't bubble at all, and some of them bubble real bad. That I've never really understood. Maybe you just ain't holding my mouth right. Now I do have one of the, the wands, spring loaded wands, and you can use the auto siphon where it will automatically stop when it gets to a certain point. But I like using this to do my bottling with. And I got this carboy from actually from Walmart for like $15. I like this carboy because it makes it uh, easy for back sweetening. Because it's got extra space for back sweetening for a three gallon batch. And then it's got this handy little siphon on the side for doing bottling, just like we're doing right now. I, I like this bottle, this, uh, this cheap carboy because the standard carboys that I got were like. $45 a piece. Or the industrial grade carboys, I guess I should say. So this Walmart one here is cheap, but it's come in very handy and does the exact same thing. Alright, we're down to bottle number 8, so this is the last one we're going to do for this video in the interest of keeping this video short. Like I said, I'd like to thank all my new subscribers and everybody that's taking the time to watch my videos and help this channel grow. I greatly appreciate your time and interest in learning to, to make wine, making homemade wine at home. Thank you for tuning in to Stranded Sailors Wines. I greatly appreciate your support. And there's your eighth bottle. See, it is a yellow color, 12.5%. There's your nice cork. Cork inside. Let's take a sip. This nice pineapple wine. Thank you everybody for tuning in today to help bottle this watermelon wine. There ain't nothing quite as fine as drinking some watermelon or pineapple wine on a hot summer's afternoon. And here's to you. Cheers. To all my supporters of Stranded Sailors Wine, thank you. I greatly appreciate it. And until next time, if you drink, don't drive, do the watermelon crawl, y'all. Goodbye. Until next time, thank you.